Um, another tough away game tomorrow night. But, I mean, in the last two performances, even though we lost at Luton on Saturday, there have been a lot of positives, and that's what we've got to build on, really, isn't it? Absolutely, Bruce. I think we've just shown the players the goals against um, upstairs, and I've broke it down into every little detail of what could have been prevented, bearing in mind one up. And, and I actually asked the players what they think, and some of them actually go, yeah, that's me, that's me. And that's a great sign that we're reviewing it in a way of let's eradicate these errors because we are we played really well in the game against a really top side um, and I thought that we deserved more but we didn't get more so we've got to look at that we can't say it's enough to play well and not get the result um, and it was fresh because uh, you know I think there's a belief in there that we we were organised we dictated play at times we, work ethic was fantastic substitutions were strong when they come on so it was uh, encouraging. Yeah, you know, sometimes it's just concentration and it's little lapses in concentration that can be the difference, can't they? Oh, well, they're game changers. They are game changers and um, we, it, we've broken down into fine detail. So they are aware um, and they are happy, I think, to take accountability as I have to take accountability for it. You know, and um, I don't think we're far away from a, a win and a run. And I think it's very important that we keep that ethic that we are not... Um, uh, playing bad, but we do need to make sure we, if someone's going to score a goal against us, it's got to be a good goal, you know. Two games against Colchester early in the season, very tight, a 1-1 draw in the league, a 1-0 win in the Checker Trade Trophy. Mm. Imagine it'll be similar tomorrow, won't it? I think so. They may have some injuries, we have to see their team, but they've won five, I think, on the trot at home, so they're strong, but we won We won a few and then lost to the Stevens. I think records are, are there for us to go there in a, in a positive vein. They are a good side, but... Every game is, you know, it's, I keep repeating myself, they're going to be tough games. We've just got to make sure we do our homework on them, um, that we're organised, um, and certainly we've got the goals and creativity to win games. Third game in a week, I know we've got a couple of injuries with Joe and uh, Matt Harrell, but there's still the opportunity, if you want to, to freshen things up tomorrow, isn't there? Yeah, there is, and also I was really pleased with the team, and I do, you know, they're training today, and I, Matt will do the training, I'll observe the players and see where exactly where they're at, and I also talk to players, you know. Dean Cox, how he feels, and Jimmy, how he feels, you know, in terms of their levels. And sometimes the players know their levels, and you've got to ask them how they are. You know, I'll, I'll look at the stats from Mark, but it's also important for players to tell me exactly what they're feeling and for me to trust that uh, instinct and, and their word.